my name is Patricia Valdez and I'm here to present to you the food truck craze. Now food trucks have invaded San Antonio and as of 2012 the popularity has grown. Now in this presentation you will get a taste or at least hope to give you a small taste of the food truck. Now food trucks have actually been around dating back to the 19th century back when they used to sell food from push carts and chuck wagons to feed the cattlemen back in the day. Now most recently as of May of 2012 the City Council along with our Mayor Julian Castro approved a food truck pilot that would allow food trucks to set up in downtown San Antonio. Now bear in mind initially that this pilot was only supposed to last for six months. Well once the locals got a taste of the amazing authentic dishes that these food trucks had to offer ranging anywhere from Tex-Mex to authentic Korean food. At that point the craze definitely took off. Now at almost every major and local event that is held especially downtown you will definitely see an array of food trucks serving up their signature. Now currently there are approximately over 50 food trucks that you can find registered in San Antonio however that may not include those who are barely starting up their food truck business or may not be fully registered um, so the number could definitely be higher and it's certainly catching on um, as the popularity grows. Now do also bear in mind that a lot of these cooks or chefs um, who own these food trucks um, do have some culinary experience um, and they're definitely have the expertise needed um, to cook up the same type of meal that you would get at a five-star restaurant. So, you know, for some of these locals, it gives them the ability to actually taste high-quality food without having to pay the high price. So, if you're ever in downtown San Antonio or San Antonio in general, you're likely to come across a food truck. So, I'd recommend that you stop, have a bite to eat, and enjoy. Um, the different variety of food that these food trucks have to offer. It's definitely catching on. I know for some major local cities um, this has been going on for some time. San Antonio seemed to kind of be lagging in that area but they've definitely caught on at this point and the feedback is just tremendous and some of these uh, food truck owners or chefs shall I call them have actually made a name for themselves and they're also growing in popularity. Um, one in particular um, who food truck goes by the name of the Chili Queens um, have actually made local news um, and even the Food Network. Um, so it definitely gives these chefs um, an opportunity to make a name for themselves um, to allow them to get the experience that they need if they do wish to open up their own restaurant someday. So it's definitely a win-win situation for both the food truck owners and the locals as well. So if you're ever in San Antonio stop by at a food truck have a bite to eat and where there's a food truck there's likely to be an ice cold beer somewhere around so the two and two go hand in hand take in the scenery and enjoy allow those taste boats to take over thank you